Hello everybody, this is Mateo from ProFlamenco. Welcome to my class. Uh, in today's lesson, I would like to show you uh, a beautiful introduction, a beautiful uh, progression of chords uh, that you can use as an introduction mm, to many flamenco styles that are in this harmony, in this key, so B minor or F sharp phrygian. So uh, if you want to study it, uh, please take your guitar, focus, and let's continue together. Let's start. So basically, this progression of chords uh, this introduction is based on four chords. Uh, our first chord uh, will be uh, B, mi B minor. With some additions, I will talk about it later. The second chord will be uh, A major or A7. Uh, the third chord will be G major or G major 7. And the last one, the last chord will be F sharp major. So in this introduction we have the main melody uh, and uh, we make some uh, harmony using the arpeggios and changing the chords, yeah? So I will play now for you the basic melody, okay? So this is the basic melody. So now we will combine the melody with the arpeggios in the right hand and with, uh, with the chord, yeah, with the chord additions. So uh, I play always the melody uh, apoyando, using the apoyando technique in the right hand, so landing on the adjacent strings, yeah. Uh, to make this melody more underlined, yes, yeah? so to to make it m more powerful, uh, more rich in sound. Uh, but you can also play this melody normally tirando, yes, yeah? so with the free stroke. Uh, um, so the um, the stroke goes in the air in the right hand, yeah. So uh, let's start with uh, this uh, progression. So this is our first phrase slowly. So once again, main melody, and then... So... So after you play the melody, you can make... bit uh, fun you can experiment with the arpeggio yeah so uh, there is no uh, like uh, um, certain rhythmical structure you can uh, make fun with this rhythm so you can experiment and this is all free yeah so this is the the first phrase you can change the rhythm of the arpeggio as you want then the second phrase Once again, in slow tempo. So you play the, I play the melody. Uh, apoyando, so with the rest stroke in the right hand and then all free stroke. And then the third phrase in slow tempo. So a little bit faster. And then the last phrase. So 
once again in the slower, slower tempo. So you focus to underline this melody, yes? Yeah? So In the left hand, uh, you just uh, first of all you hit the uh, open string, and then you press without bar eh? only the fourth strings, yeah, because you you have to have the B string open, and then you close the bar. Eh? So once again a little bit faster So now let's repeat together all four phrases really really slowly okay so the first phrase then the second phrase then the third phrase The last one, and please remember to play all these phrases very, very freely. Yeah, so in a very free way, without a, a, without a specific rhythm, without a tempo. Yeah, so uh, ad libitum, uh, toque libre in Spanish. So take your time, yeah? You, you just have to underline the melody and then just, then just swim with it, yeah? You can also change the arpeggio, yeah? So, could, so you can play, for example, the, the melody and then... For example, like this, you can experiment with the arpeggio in the right hand. So the arpeggio in the right hand is really, really powerful in, uh, in the introduction like this, yeah? So you can experiment with the um, de descending arpeggio and the, and the ascending arpeggio and with different uh, alterna uh, alterations in the fingering. So this is all up to you, yeah? So after this introduction, you can, for example, start the uh, um, rumba strumming or rumba uh, arpeggios so you can start the rhythm, you can start the compass, yes? So this is a, a kind of beautiful uh, introduction which you can use in many different flamenco styles, yeah? Okay, and that's it, well done, congratulations, good job! Uh, I hope that everything is clear for you now and that you like the lesson. Uh, if you have any questions to me, please ask in the comment, I will answer all of them. Uh, I would like to thank you for your presence and thank you for your watching. Uh, if you are interested in flamenco guitar lessons, please subscribe to my channel. I will be posting a flamenco guitar lesson two times a week. Uh, I would like to invite you also for, uh, to my social media, all the links uh, are in the description below so you can follow me, I would be uh, grateful for that. So once again, thank you for your presence and thank you for watching and we see you in the next lesson. So goodbye. Thanks.